Can Levi or any male become the female titan? So what's up guys, Foxen here. Fun Attack on Titan topic today, and it's actually a question I see pretty often. Can any male gain the powers of the sexy female titan? In other words, get Annie outside of her crystal, then have someone like Eren eat Annie. Let's go ahead and delve into this. First off, let me mention this. By males, let's go ahead and stick with the physical male body. In other words, you got a mini titan down there. Or would that be a colossal titan? Hmm. Anyway, so far from what you know about the Titan Shifter powers, in theory this should be possible. The first problem is that damn crystal that Annie put herself in. For this video, let's just assume that Annie is already out, or a Titan could simply swallow that thing like a pill. Then we got the second issue that I know people will bring up. Where would Paradise Island even get more Titan juice? Again, for this one, let's just keep it simple. Let's say they found one or Hanji made some. If you really wanted to, you could think of over a hundred reasons for how they got some. Alright, so you got the ingredients ready. You got a fresh Annie and some Titan juice. What would happen if you took a guy, let's go ahead and say Erwin, make his blonde ass into a Titan, and then you had Erwin eat Annie, what would happen? Would the female Titan have some huge eyebrows? For this, I see two possibilities. The first being that everything works as normal. What I mean by this is that regardless of whether the user is a female or male, the result will still be something similar to Annie's female Titan. The only slight difference would be the face. In the case of Erwin, he would lose his manly features when he turned into the female Titan. Whether you're female or male, Titans already don't have anything down there. They're like Barbie dolls. On the other hand, Erwin would gain a little extra in certain areas. One thing we could possibly reference for why this would work like this is just imagine what Annie's mindless Titan would look like. You might also be able to use Dina as an example. Both of these two lost their female features and surely didn't look anything like how the female titan's body does. Anyway, that was the possible scenario where a male takes a power, no problems. However, what would happen if that was not the case? Perhaps the female titan does represent Ymir's female traits. So here's the negative outcome for Erwin. Erwin eats Annie, then he uses her ring to cut himself. Boom, titan mode. Except no actual female titan appears. What comes out is only a titan a little stronger than a mindless version. But what about the female's ability to get hard? Nope, sorry, not possible. About her power to scream and draw in titans? Sorry, not available either. It'll just be a whimper. In other words, the result here is pretty much a half-assed titan shifter. But why do I think this would be the case? The reason is just cause it might have already happened once before. Let's go ahead and look at Ymir. There still is this mystery about why Ymir's Titan looks weaker and is missing some features compared to the past and new Jaws Titan. Could it possibly have been due to not being compatible with the Jaws Titan? If you think back, Ymir was after all just some random kid. This actually does bring something up from the current Marley arc. Remember what Gabby said. Gabby brings up about how compatibility is important for passing down memories. I think there's a lot more potential for this. How about if compatibility extends to more than just memories? For example, a taller person having better control of the Colossal Titan. Or like a buffed out dude like the Rock being more in control of the Armor Titan. In the case of Ymir, she just wasn't compatible, which resulted in a weaker Titan Shifter. In the case of a male turning into the sexy Titan, that special compatibility could require being a female. So back to the original question, could a male become the female Titan? For this, there's two possibilities. Either it works no problem, or there is in fact a female requirement. A male trying to become the female titan would just result in one weaker than the female one, but at the same time stronger than the normal base version. But hey, that's an attack on titan theory. More important, let me hear your thoughts. Question of the day, do you think a male can become the female titan? Which scenario do you think is more likely? Would there be no issues at all? Or do you think the resulting titan would have some issues? If you enjoyed this fun topic, definitely give this a close thumbs up and subscribe. You could expect 5 or more anime videos every week. A lot of those are Attack on Titan ones. By the way, talking about Titans, Season 3 of Attack on Titan is just around the corner. Check out my video on how they could make Attack on Titan Season 3 even better. And I'll see you guys later.